Hey everybody, Yuri Matsu here, and today I'll be reviewing the Vivic floor mats for this Toyota Tacoma Crew Cab. We're going to find out how do they compare to the OEM floor mats, so let's go ahead and find out. So first off, the OEM Tacoma uh, floor mats, they're very rubbery and flexible. So the new Vivic ones, they're a little bit more tough and robust. They don't bend as much. It's more of like a hard plastic as opposed to a rubber finish. Now we're gonna do a water test to see which one of them holds the most water before it starts to overflow. So the Toyota Tacoma actually failed with a full 16 ounce container and it was not capable of actually maintaining and holding the entire canteen in there. So that is uh, not as good as I expected it would do, but let's go ahead and see how the Vivic one does. Well, one canteen down, still has room for more. So two canteens in, and it looks like it's just about to start rolling over into these uh, little rings here. But let's see how much further before it actually starts failing. And that's at about two and a half of these canteens and it's starting to leak through this ring here. So it holds quite a bit more water than the original OEM Tacoma uh, floor mat. So that already is a win for the Philwick. Now let's see how well they run off. And yes, the Toyota Tacoma one is used before. So it's not really apples to apples here, but we just see how well it runs off and you can see that Still quite a bit of water retention, even from a quick uh, shake. Let's see how these do for water repelling. Definitely repel a lot better. Again, this is brand new, so maybe with some time and some scuffing won't be as good, but uh, I would say that it's definitely a win for the Bewick on the water repelling as well. You know, at least from here, you can probably just wipe it down with a clean cloth and it's gonna be good as new. This one's gonna require a little bit more scrubbing. So that is also another nice plus for these floor mats. Now, as far as fitment goes, see they're about, see they're about the same. Yeah, I'd say they're just fairly similar with just some lip here on the Vivic being a little bit taller. And uh, this actually rolls over a little bit more than the Vivic does. So the OEM one, I think is a little bit nicer for the probably entry. Now we're gonna go inside the truck and see how it actually fits and see which one has the final best fit up for the Toyota Tacoma. So we're first gonna start off with the Toyota Tacoma floor mats. And what's nice about these is it's really easy to put in and they lock in place pretty well. I like that this lip does come over the edge and it's molded really well to the interior of the truck. So. I'm really curious to see if those Bewick are gonna be as good or not, but so far, I mean, just by looking at it, I think the Toyota Tacoma floor mats are gonna have a better fit and finish. And when you're sitting inside the truck, this is what it's gonna sound like when you're wet. Now the Bewick is a little bit more harder to maneuver, but it gets in pretty well. And I'd say it's pretty good. It, it's not as flush here. You can see that it does rock a little bit back and forth. So fitment is not that great in here, but better coverage, uh, at least on the corners. So again, for water retention, if you keep on walking in and out, uh, the Bailiwick is definitely gonna be better in maintaining and keeping that water in one place. And to get in, well, it's not that loud, quieter than the Toyota Tacoma ones. So, yeah, I think they do really well. Now, as far as the scratch test goes and puncture, we're going to start off with the Vivic ones first. It's a little bit hard plastic, so I expect there to be some sort of marring. And I am using a Leatherman, so this is pretty sharp. And you can see that uh, it will scratch see if I can poke through this easily or not. 
uh, quite a bit of force is required to actually puncture through this. So I would say it's probably going to withstand most abuse uh, with this, but uh, you probably will have to worry about this getting ugly over time because this is a hard plastic. So this may not hold up as well as the rubber, which we're going to test out here in a second. So on the OEM ones, you're scratching it. It's not as apparent. Uh, it actually takes the scratches a lot better and it's a lot more hidden, I think, compared to how the VU is hard plastic. So I'm not gonna poke a hole in this because this is my brother-in-law's. So we're gonna go ahead and I would assume that's gonna go through a lot easier because it is rubber, but taking a scratch, this is definitely gonna be a lot better material for the long haul. If you're worried about it getting ugly from abuse, just constant uh, you know, scuffing of the shoes. So this will probably take the win there. Just for shits and giggles, this is the Buick compared to a Husky liner. And uh, again, the Husky one is also a hard plastic. It's kind of hard to maneuver and bend. And so this is probably how the Buick is gonna look like after you know a year's worth of use. Um, you know, we're here in Canton, Georgia, and so we got the red clay, so it's a little bit dirtier than usual. Uh, you may not have that everywhere, but it's it's definitely dulled out. And uh, I wouldn't say that scratches are like apparent here, but you know, there are scuffs here uh, that you know you're gonna get over time. But it's holding up pretty good for one year, so I would expect no less from the Buick to look like the Husky when it's done. Um, it's actually interesting to see the Husky. This is off a Honda Ridgeline and not a Toyota Tacoma, but this is just for a comparison here. Uh, the, the Husky does have a much deeper lip to retain a lot more water, so that is a bonus for Huskies. But again, the Buick does do better than the OEM Toyota Tacoma floor covers, so this is a good upgrade for those looking for something. You know, maybe you don't want to spend the money like a Husky, but you want to get something a little bit better. A quick comparison of the mats show that the Viwick mats definitely have a big lip here and a lot more protection than the OEM floor mat from Toyota. So this is going to hold a lot more dirt and keep it away from your truck if that's something that you're looking forward to do. Otherwise, again, the Toyota Tacoma is a rubber finish, super soft, it looks good. Honestly, I think this actually looks a little bit better because it is a matte finish. However, the Viwick does probably offer a little bit more protection. Here we have a comparison of the Toyota Tacoma passenger seat floor mat and the Buick passenger seat floor mat. Again, you can see that it's quite a bit deeper. And again, fit and finish. Seems like the Toyota Tacoma is a little bit better fit and finish than the Buick. However, again, if you're looking for, you know, retention, uh, the Toyota Tacoma mat is not gonna do as well. So here we can see the fit and finish of the Toyota floor mat on the driver's side. Everything seems to sit really well. Moving to the back seats, again, everything sits really well. It definitely looks like everything's been designed exactly for this truck, and it looks really good back here. Uh, there's not too much wobble here in the center. And then the passenger seat also. It's really nice and tight, flush, and looks really good. Now the Vewick does sit really well inside the Toyota Tacoma. However, I would say it's not as fit and finish as the OEM one, but it does do well and does retain a lot more water than the OEM, and it looks really good. The rear actually, however, is surprisingly nicer than the OEM. It actually wraps around the center console here, all the way up to the front and uh, it doesn't budge at all. This has zero budge. It's like a much better fit and finish on the rear. It's a little bit here in the corner, but it might be because it's just been in a box. The right side actually looks a little bit better. Um, so I do like that uh, it actually comes up quite high here and it does give you a little bit so like the back of your feet don't hit the back of the uh, floor here. So a little bit of protection here, that's very nice. As well as the passenger side, it does look really good. It does fit a little bit better on the passenger side than on the driver's side, I think. And again, looks good. 
Everything fits well, the holes match up perfectly on both the driver's side and passenger side. So you don't get that nice Toyota Tacoma emblem on here though, but that's okay. So if you're looking to upgrade from the OEM Tacoma floor mats, this Vivic is a good option. It's fairly well priced and the link will be down below in the description if you guys are interested. So if you like this video, hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on all the latest video releases. Thanks for watching.